The Indian stock market experienced a strong rally on Monday, but this was followed by a sharp sell-off in early morning deals on Tuesday. The Nifty 50 index lost over 1,800 points, touching an intraday low of 21,300, while the BSE Sensex fell over 4,600 points, reaching an intraday low of 70,285. Now, let's delve into the reasons for this market uncertainty. Firstly, we need to consider the impact of exit poll results. Exit polls are surveys conducted immediately after voters leave polling stations, aiming to predict the election outcomes by asking voters who they supported. These polls provide an early insight into the likely results. Recent exit polls predicted a landslide victory for the NDA government led by the BJP, projecting that they would win over 350 out of the 543 seats in Lok Sabha elections of 2024. However, the early election results have not aligned with these exit polls, causing disappointment among investors. This unexpected divergence has led to a significant fall in the stock market. Secondly, we have the surge in the India VIX index. The India VIX index measures the market's expectation of volatility over the next 30 days. Today, it surged by 48%, reaching a new 52-week peak of 31.06. This increase indicates heightened market volatility, reflecting the increased uncertainty and leading investors to anticipate larger price swings in the near term. Overall, even if the final vote count for the NDA falls short of the exit poll predictions, the BJP led NDA is nearing the 300 seat mark, surpassing the 272 mark, suggesting a stable government. Investors are likely to focus on the broader economic context and long term growth prospects rather than short term political fluctuations, helping the market remain relatively stable despite the initial volatility. Now, several factors also suggest that the market may stabilize in the long term. First is policy continuity. Investors are reassured that the general policy direction will remain consistent even if there are minor fluctuations in electoral outcomes. This continuity provides stability and predictability, which are crucial for the market confidence. Next is indigenization efforts. Government efforts to promote domestic industries and reduce dependency on imports are viewed positively by investors. These initiatives can increase confidence in the long-term sustainability of the economy. Then there is strong fundamentals. The underlying economic fundamentals of India remains robust, indicating resilience and strength in the economy. And finally, GDP growth. India's GDP for the fourth quarter of financial year 24 grew by 7.8% year-on-year, up from 6.2% in the same period last year. This growth exceeded analysts' expectations, which were below 7%. This evidence of sustained GDP growth further boosts market sentiment. Having said that, this is Aditi Priya signing off. Investments in securities market are subject to market risks. Read all the related documents carefully before investing.